is Saturday the, I really do need to work on getting these days right, don't I? The 10th of November. I have literally just started properly looking at Christmas presents. Um, I feel like really behind this year. Normally I get quite organised, but um, I don't know. I've just not got into it yet. I really need to crack on. Um, you'll have to forgive me for this video as well. I'm just checking the time. It's quarter to four. And um, I haven't really vlogged anything, have I? Uh, Bill is with his dad for the weekend. He was here this morning until one bless his little heart. He was, um, he started making cards before school on Friday morning for loads of his friends and took them in. And I was like, babe, what are those? What have you been making? And he said, mama, these are for all my friends to let them know how important they are to me because they're like family. And like that little boy, He's, uh, he's older than his years sometimes, you know. He'll make a great friend to anyone in the future, I think. He's got such a kind heart. Um, but he's made some anyway, taking them in. So much so that um, one of the mums sent me a photo and was like, oh, this is what Bill has given Jack today. And I was like, oh, bless him. Bless his heart. And it's nice to think that he's like made some of the children smile and the mums smile too. Um, and yeah he made two more this morning and he's taken those with him to his dad so he can give them to his friends on um monday morning which is really cute but he's run out of card now so i need to get him some more because he wants to keep making the people which you know i can't argue with that um and yeah he is a wise man slash king i'm not really sure what route they're going for in his christmas Thing at school uh, and he's so proud I'm so proud he's got five lines and um, so he's taking those to his dad's as well to um, you know start working on and stuff and um, it's so exciting because the older they get they they do so much more and it's so exciting um, to sort of see him you know just get a bit older and take on more responsibilities and do more things for him like that I think when you have babies and toddlers you can't ever imagine like having an older child being as like cute and sweet and you know lovely like when they really need you when they're little but I have to say having an older child is amazing because you're watching them work out who they want to be and what they're into and it's just like seeing like the most beautiful person grow Um it really is lovely I realize I sound quite poetic today but I do I mean it <laughs> Um but yeah we've just been having a lazy a lazy day and um sometimes that's quite needed doesn't it i've not been feeling fantastic i don't know if i'm coming down with something I always seem to be coming down with something at the moment it's really annoying um but what we're gonna do because i feel bad for the little two um not really getting out today so far mark and i have decided something that we rarely do with the kids to actually go out for tea with them normally we do it in the day because like in the daytime you you go out with kids and kids are around in the day, aren't they? But in the evening, I always sometimes feel a bit nervous about taking, like, them all out because, like, people go on dates at night, don't they? And they do all that. And, like, sometimes you get, like, those looks, like, where you can tell people a bit, like, okay, your kids are quite noisy. And I'm like, well, you know, <laughs> they're kids. Um, and I, I always feel, like, a bit nervous about it. But um, I think it'd be quite fun to just go out. And we're only going to Weatherspoons because, to be honest with you, it's quite, it's nice and cheap, isn't it? Um, and the one near us is actually quite nice because um, I don't know about you where the spoons can be like anything from lovely to like am I even safe in here <laughs> there was some um, near me that are like whoa um, but yeah this one's quite nice and we're just going to go for a cheap and cheerful dinner I think and have a walk and I might have like a glass of wine or something while I'm there because you know it's Saturday yep. but I am um, I'm finally putting some makeup on which is so pointless because I'll probably take it off around like eight o'clock or something but um yeah that is just where i'm up to um so i will probably film like more of the evening of today because uh, normally i tend to like stop filming um in the evening so mark and i can just have like private time because um well we just like to kill up on the sofa together and watch like rubbish telly and like talk about absolute I was going to say a naughty word, but you might be watching my children, so I won't. Um, but you know, like, it's just nice to switch off. But I might share a bit more tonight. Um, he's downstairs with the kids. The last time I looked, he had a rabbit mask on his face and looked really creepy. And Stan was laughing at him, so I'm assuming they're still doing something like that. Um, and yeah, so I'm going to go and sort my face out and spruce myself up a little bit. And I'll see you in a little while.
in the evening i don't know why we got in that habit i think we're always like stuck into like routine and bedtime and oh they'll be too tired and that kind of thing but it was really really nice like stan just ate the entire time we, we were there he just kept shoveling food into his mouth and smiling and then daisy was all over the place like on our knees and having cuddles and being cute and silly and we got rid of it in the end of like some ice cream and fruit and she was well happy and it was nice to give her a little bit of one-on-one -on -one time too because like she is our middle baby and um she's like at that age it's like kind of awkward in between where she's like a toddler but not yet a girl like the britney spears equivalent of toddlers i guess you know like but she's almost there at like proper conversations and stuff but she can't always express herself but she's been amazing tonight and so funny and then we were in the living room before when we got back um i didn't film it because she was just in a nappy and i didn't feel like right about doing it um but she was like singing loads of nursery rhymes with us and like going what one do you want to sing next and we were like mm, <laughs> i think but we sang loads um and then we watched a tiny bit of strictly and now they're in bed so i am just having a look in the fridge I think I'm going to pour myself a glass of Prosecco um I bought this on Friday and I've just thought I was going to have a couple of glasses but I didn't bother in the end um so I'm gonna have a glass or two of that and then Mark suggested before that we watch Rock of Ages which is a film that we watched when we were first like I don't know, getting together I suppose, and I love like anything like that, it's like musical film type things, it's really really good, it got Catherine Zeta Jones singing in it, and someone else, I can't remember, that's famous, I forget, but it's really really good if you like that kind of thing, like you know like Mamma Mia and Greatest Showman, it's kind of like a musical film spectacular type thing, and um, yeah he suggested we watch that, so I'm well happy, because it just reminds me, like I can remember when we watched it, and our living room in there hadn't had any work done yet and we had like old leather sofas that used to be my grandparents and they were so cold and we used to like slide off them most of the time but yeah we watched it back on my carpet it was like a kaleidoscope it was like you couldn't stare at it for too long because it would make your mind go crazy and it um, takes me back to those days where we were like getting to know each other properly and like seeing if it would work and I'm excited to watch it I've not seen it since then and that must be like We'll be together five years in January, so I would say about four and a half, even more years ago. So yeah, that's what we're gonna do. I'm gonna go for a drink anyway and go and enjoy myself. Could 
hear my father's voice He would tell me to move on He would say I'll be just fine yeah. He would tell me we have time Time to laugh and time to hear A favorite song is on Drinking wine until the dawn Knowing soon we'll be back home is tomorrow and then Stan is eight months old tomorrow which is mental but anyway um we just kind of got on with things today you don't really know where the morning went um Mark had a lie in this morning because I had one yesterday and he's been for a run and Daisy and I watched a lot of Peppa Pig this morning and um, we sang the bing bong boo bong bing bing bong I don't that's the bing bong song that's it we sang that a lot of time um, and then we went to go and visit my mum and dad um, I just really felt like seeing them and my mum and dad if you remember from a few weeks back um, they're actually moving house they've sold their house and they could be moving before Christmas or it will be early on in January which is really exciting but it's just kind of hit me that my family home that I grew up in for the most part anyway I won't ever get to go back to you again and um, I just wanted to go and I wanted to see my mum and my dad and I wanted to see Gino, um, our dog and what else, yeah I might be going back to stay over on in a couple of weekends time as well um, but yeah that's that's it really, we've been to Aldi as well because um, I didn't manage to do a grocery order this week which I hate because I didn't like doing meal plan or anything so like for the week ahead I'm absolutely clueless and I really do need to try and get one done um, but it's annoying because you know when you're in a routine and you're like I like it to come on a Friday because then we're all set up for the weekend um, whereas now I could really do with ordering something today to come tomorrow really because otherwise like I have no idea what we're eating this week put it that way but yeah it's fine it's fine I would have thought that out at some point but I'm just putting food away at the moment um, Mark has gone to the shops he's gone to waitrose because um yeah, aldi yes yeah. so where was i sorry i had to just help daisy with something um yeah mark's gone to waitrose though because he 
need to get Stan's milk um, because obviously Aldi don't really sell like milk apart from their own sometimes that optimal one at least ours doesn't anyway sorry i keep getting really distracted by it because she's just been so freaking cute um yeah i got what did i do got a pie out the freezer we're gonna have that made that a few weeks ago so i think it's like a beef ale and stilton pie and then i've got ready-made mash already that'll pimp out with a bit of extra butter and seasoning i think and then i've got some sprouts and asparagus and we also got some Yorkshire puddings that are ready made just because we both looked at them and we were like yes you can come home with us so that's basically what we're having for tea I think I've just like really enjoyed having a really quiet low-key unfussed weekend Um I'm really missing Bill but um I get to see him tomorrow uh, but it's just it's a different dynamic when he's not here he brings such like a lightness to the house um, he's so happy-go-lucky and like a big dreamer and he's just very pleasant to be around he really really is um, so I can't wait to see him tomorrow but we're gonna kind of have a lazy one I'm feeling really tired like I'm coming down with something and Mark suggested that I have a nap but do you ever feel like sometimes with a nap you just end up sleeping the day away and then that's it it's done it's the weekend it's gone and then you can't really get that time back so I don't know if I'm just gonna hold out until bedtime but yeah I'm gonna go now and get dinner all prepped and just relax, I think, because I just feel like I need it. Yum, 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 yum. Is that nice? 